Twice a year, Seven Circles conducts a, a vision quest uh, up in Laytonville, California, Northern California, the mountains up there, a beautiful place. And the vision quest is uh, where you go up on the uh, on the mountain. They say up the hill quite often. You go on a four-day uh, fast of food, no food, no water, and uh, it's. Uh, allows you to be uh, uh, in tune with Mother Nature because you're out there in the woods on the mountain and uh, you're just there by yourself with no uh, other other than the creatures that, uh, that uh, own the hill. And uh, so it's a very beautiful ceremony and people come down, the women come floating down like they're angels and the men come down after four days in water, no, no food and water, come down looking really ragged. But after they break fast, everybody regenerates in a really good way, and we have a feast afterwards. And essentially, that's uh, what it amounts to. When people want to seek a vision or seek a direction in their lives, then they, uh, they uh, do the vision quest. And it's a very beautiful ceremony. There's a lot of support there, and, uh, and uh, you're, you, get, you got a lot of help. You got a personal helper that carries your pack up that belongs in your altar, and, they got a, and you carry only the sacred pipe. Yeah. First day, we'll, uh, we'll, when we get there, we'll set you down and we'll make sure you got everything ready for your altar and make sure you got an eagle feather for the waluto. They call the waluto, uh, this is a word that says this is for the people. You're doing it not only for yourself, but for the, all the people. And uh, then uh, we, uh, we eat together and after midnight that first day, you don't eat anymore or drink anymore. And we blow the conch about Daybreak the next morning, got about an hour to get up and bring your stuff up to the sweat lodge, which is all very close. And uh, then we uh, uh, ask you why you want to do the vision quest, and uh, so the base camp will be a part uh, part of your uh, vision quest. And then uh, we load the sacred pipes, and then we uh, go in the sweat lodge for just one round, one round, dusting off rounds, seven stones, and one uh, song and a prayer to song, and you're out. They get all lined up, getting ready to go up the hill. So we'll break the uh, path to going up the uh, up the hill with the song, and then usually uh, there's a baby up there. You have that innocence. We open up the path, going up the hill, and then uh, the first in line is the vision quest, carrying only the sacred pipe, and then his personal helper, and then on and on and on. Uh, six or seven or eight uh, vision questions. They only carry the pipe. And then the drummer will be singing, and at a certain point he'll drop the drum off, and then they have what we call the main helpers. And, they, uh, and the personal helper carries your backpack, and the main helper will set up the altar, flags and sage on the ground, so prayer ties. You're covered, you're surrounded by prayer and you're, while you're in your altar there. <clears throat> and then on, the, on the, the next day, we get you locked in, that expression is getting locked, getting locked in, there's doors there, we lock you in after you pray over you. And then uh, the next morning you'll hear a song there in the mountains there somewhere, when somebody at base camp will be singing to let you know we're down here eating and drinking for you. And at uh, before noon or a little after in that area, time of the day, we'll be checking on you with binoculars and once you see you move, you're okay. And that's the, the, that's the first, second second day and then the third day you'll hear the drum and you'll be checked on again on the fourth day you'll uh, hear the conch and that means to come down and bring only the pipe this altar requires you to only bring the sacred pipe down and the helpers will go up and get your altar stuff and bring it down but when you come down to the sweat lodge we take your pipe and you sit down and you have a break and fast meal and uh, it's usually water of course, and then uh, berries and corn and uh, wajnas. It's a buffalo mix of pine nuts and uh, white raisins. And that's how you break your fast. Then you go into the sweat lodge for one, one round. Before you go into the sweat lodge, so you circle up after you've get, gotten uh, regrouped by eating and drinking, you share a high, one experience, a highlight uh, uh, of your experience up there. So base camp will be a part of your vision quest like that. And then you go in and you, just, you get sweated off one round, song and a prayer and a song. And then we have a feast. And then everybody uh, has a giveaway. We'll circle up and have a giveaway. We have a giveaway of every ceremony. And uh, because we receive something good, we want to honor that uh, feeling good. And we, so we give, uh, have a giveaway. So we'll have the giveaway, and then 
then uh, everybody uh, will feast. The feast comes after the giveaway, and everybody goes home. And you're welcome to stay there, get there early, a couple of days early, and stay behind a couple of days if you want.